What about this one? Oh, is that the end? <gasps> so the program is definitely awesome. The exposure to words and concepts and cognitive thinking is a big part of not only literacy, no, no, but no, social no, emotional no awareness. And one more. I knew Tell I could use that. this tool to not only bond with my son, but also give him skills that he would need in everyday daily life. What's that? A car. A car? What color is that car? Um, yellow. I heard a story from a a woman who did a lot of volunteering in D.C., and she talked about how she had this group of students, and she would have folks come in, and once, once a week she'd go over and she'd read. So after doing this for a couple of weeks, she then reached out and said, all right, um, how about everybody bring their favorite book from home? And so the next week rolls around, and half the kids brought their favorite book from home. A few other kids had forgotten their book, um, and some she thought maybe they actually forgot, maybe they didn't have a book to bring home. But she remembers so powerfully one kid who came in, and brought in a book and very proudly pulled it out. And it was a phone book. And it was the only book they had in their house. That story is so powerful to me. I do not like green eggs. We know from all of the research that children who are read to, sung to as well um, at home, have a vocabulary that is vastly larger than children, unfortunately, who come to school without that type of preparation. Open the book. Truck stop. He will repeat a word and understand it and later on repeat it and, and use it in the way that it was used with him. And I realized that his exposure to these books has really expanded his vocabulary. And what's this? This is, what's this? What do you see? What's that? A truck. A truck with what? Teaching him another language is something that I've always had an interest in. And getting those English, Spanish books have been a great follow-up to songs that we sing or words that I teach him or things that he pick up at school. So the dual language books are definitely a great asset. Yeah. Abuela? Who's Abuela? We want to see kids in third grade uh, showing that they're reading at level. And if so, um, studies over and over have shown that they will be uh, much more likely to graduate and, you know, and launch careers. That's your favorite one? And put it back over there. What's the name of that book?